Hi loves, welcome back to another video with your girl Moya. You are watching Baddies in a Bag. Today is, what day is today? March 1st and we are heading to the bag because it is rent day, it's bills day, it's time to pay the bills. So we are about to head to the bank to deposit our bills and get them paid. today is recharge yourself more often than you charge your phone oh okay take a brain break every hour or finish the work day one hour earlier than usual recharge before you feel tired oh my god I feel like I needed that message because me I have so many things going on in my mind I'd be wanting to complete everything at once so I feel like this is a message for me to slow down. Let's get our cash tray and our bills binder so we can unstuff. All right, here we are. Into the bills binder we go. Let's move to phone bill. Inside phone bill we should have 120. That is 120. How you guys been? What's going on with you guys? Are you guys happy that it's bills time? not me i know i'm not happy <laughs> next we have rent let's take out the rent should be 800 20 40 60 20 100 20 40 60 82 20 40 60 83 20 40 60 84 20 40 60 85 20 40 60 86 20 40 60 87 20, 40, 60, 88, 800, moving right along, we're heading to utilities, this should be 75, here's our 75, 60, 70, and let's drop the 5 right there. After utilities, we have self lender. Should be 35. There's our 35 for self thunder. Okay. Insurance. This is a uh, fifth, a hundred and fifteen. Did I take out the $50 out of credit cards? I used the money that I had on my card to pay on my credit cards because I didn't have the amount on my card I had it. So let me see if I removed it. No, I didn't remove it. So I should have removed the $50 from credit cards. It's supposed to go on top of my insurance to make my insurance $150. Here's the 150 for insurance. That's 100. This is 140, 50. We're paying the insurance. So here's what happened. Basically, I had some extra cash on my card. I think it was around $70 that I received from a makeup appointment that I did that I had after the big appointments that I had. I had like an extra makeup appointment. So that makeup appointment amount was supposed to go towards insurance. What I did, because the cash was on my card, I just used that to pay on my credit cards. I used $50 out of it to pay on my credit card. And then I was supposed to move the $50 from high priority into insurance because I used the insurance money off the card. I'm supposed to move it back. So that's what that was, and this is what I'm doing right now. This is me moving it back, basically, to make 150 for me to pay my insurance. 
so I did it looks like I did stuff an extra $15 we're going to move this into my self-care binder here we have our bank bag let's count the cash and get the cash inside of the bank bag so let me get my calculator and see how much we're supposed to have all right so we're supposed to have 800 for rent 120 for phone 75 whoops for utilities 35 for self lender and 150 for insurance so we're supposed to have 1180 here we go we have 20 40 60 80 120 40 60 82 20 40 60 83 20 40 60 84 20 40 60 85 20 40 60 86 20 40 60 87 20 40 60 88 20 40 60 89 20 40 60 80 10 20 40 60 80, 11 20 30 40 50 55 60 65 70 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 80 so here's our 1180 that we're heading to the bank with to pay our bills. Off to the bank I go. I also wanted to go over my closing for this month just to go over my expense tracker with you guys. Inside of our expense, our expense tracker this month was, whew, here's the income for this month. For this month, we brought in $3,795.13. From makeup and lashes, we brought in $1410. So, if we brought in $1410 and we have $1,180 for bills, that means we had an extra cash of $230. We had get we had purchased some makeup supplies and we have stuffed the remaining into our cash wallet. Financial aid came in. 320 I gave a hundred dollars to my mom and 220 was stuffed inside of my binders YouTube pay was 280 that went to saving challenges the website I had a total of 1058 from the website and 560 was stuffed so the 1058 was what I paid myself after all expenses and stuff from the website we were left with 1058. 560 was stuffed. No, what am I saying? We were left with 1782. That's what it says expenses. That was off of my business card. So that's also what came in off of the website that was paid to me. And then 1058, I stuffed 560 of it into my binders and I still have the remaining balance inside of my bank bag which I want to put some towards the business funds in high priority so that's basically the income for this month saving challenges we were able to add an extra 310 to saving challenges which pushed us to our 20% of our saving goal so that was good we made some credit card payments and pur purchases and I want to go over the expense tracker. Let me find the expense tracker. Here it is. So I've already done this off of camera. My monthly income chart, I did this yesterday and I did my spending tracker. On the website, we ended up spending a total of 720 on my business card. We spent 727. Where majority of that cash came from was I did went to Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, and Target and get $116 worth of stuff. And another big purchase was Afterpay, which I paid back to $17.59 to Afterpay. So that's basically the two biggest purchases. Everything else was me supporting two small businesses in the budgeting community, Pink Uni Shop and Budget by Celeste. And then the rest of it was Dollar Tree, me ordering on DoorDash, the beauty store, etc. So $7.27 was what was spent this month. And this was the income breakdown that I just told y'all about in the beginning. So $3.795 
came in 1180 pay the bills the rest was distributed between savings um, stuffing sent to mom etc so that's basically it we're done with the month of February February was a really good month unlike January <laughs> but February did its thing came through and we good we are ready for the new month thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video Thank you.